from you, knowing what he did to that woman. That's a goddamn shame. Why would you? I thought it was love all women. Or am I absolutely right that it's pick me's? And then if it's the motherfucker you go eat lunch with, or if it's the motherfucker you follow on Instagram that you like, because nobody like me, but the motherfucker you like, a punk bitch can brag and dominate a woman and then sit there and talk about it on a goddamn interview, further mentally fucking up this lady because he know his white daddy going to protect him. But you black women, y'all have been complicit in this shit. This nigga got a lot, a lot of famous black women. That's his friend. I'm going to expect you women to unfollow this son of a bitch. Are y'all, are, are y'all supporting his behavior? Why do Charlemagne the God get a pass for what he did? Because I want that pass too. How the fuck can I get a pass? I would never do something like that. But how the fuck can I be so disgusting and such a piece of shit and then I can be at the front line acting like I'm somebody peaceful and nice and put together when all I do is disrespect black men, throw bunky and penis at them and act like a, a, a weirdo because the things that he does is not even polite. You don't throw no bunky at no goddamn grown ass man. If he did that to a woman, you guys would see the bad behavior in it. Charlemagne the God, your time is ticking, boy. I know these black women. I know these black women. He said the volume too high. I know these black women gonna do what the fuck they supposed to do. I know these black women gonna get you up out of here. I know. iHeartRadio, you motherfuckers are on notice. I'm about to put together a nice little email for your ass and I might identify today so and talk to you woman to woman. Yeah, I might motherfucking identify and say as a woman, I can't see this shit no more. This motherfucker took over a woman. Yeah, motherfucker. Is this the pick me show or is somebody going to go kick Charlemagne and his motherfucking ass and drag that abusive son of a bitch out of there? Which one is it? Y'all got a lot to prove today. Y'all got a lot to goddamn prove today. We gonna see if this dumbass bus can see. And y'all fuck with this Geechee, and now I'm telling on your motherfucking ass. And yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna make sure I stay in the woods. I ain't gonna be nowhere around you motherfuckers. I got enough diesel, I'm gonna stay home. You motherfuckers better not come nowhere near me. <laughs> Tell you that right goddamn now. Leave me the fuck alone. I ain't even going to drive no more. I'm going to be in the passenger side. And you're not getting my motherfucking ID. <laughs> motherfucker. I'm going to have my lawyer on Zoom. Soon as one of you motherfuckers pull me over. I'm not talking to you niggas no more. Because I know what happened when you expose shit like this. Charlemagne punk ass in there sitting here acting like he a put together man. And he ain't nothing but a motherfucking predator. Who protecting you, boy? Who let you get up there and say anything about another black man like you some bad motherfucker? When you up here bragging on goddamn radio shows about disrespecting black women. I bet you if that was a white woman you were bragging about doing that to, that white man would have kicked you up your ass. But see, they iHeartRadio, they okay with you doing that to a black woman. Yeah. They probably bring out extra liquor when you come to the Christmas party. So one of them hoes go to sleep so you can goddamn hump them so they don't know. Punk bitch you. Yeah. You better not be around no more liquor, bitch. You can't control yourself when a girl get drunk. Nasty motherfucker. Sit up there and brag about that. I listened to that shit and I thought about my daughter and I wanted to choke the shit out your nasty ass. And you got a lot of celebrity friends. I need to go on your page and find out who all your motherfucking friends are, boy. We need to find out who the fuck is supporting this nasty shit just because they like you. Bitch, you better get your ass out that desk today, motherfucker. I'm going to be up in front of that motherfucker with a hashtag got away with it t-shirt, punk. <laughs> fuck you getting away with goddamn taking advantage of women and then you running your goddamn mouth. And when you women gonna stand up and get his punk ass up out of there? 
Y'all got work to do. I'm gonna let you get to it. I expect your resignation in 10 minutes, you punk. Get your goddamn little napkins and whatever else. You probably got little sex toys in there. You and uh, motherfucker. Well, whatever. Anyway, you probably got some freaking nads. You get that bunkie that you threw at Donnell Rollins. Pick that shit up out that draw. Wrap that shit up and get your motherfucking ass out of that office, bitch. We don't want you in that goddamn building no more. And don't nobody need to see your bunky bandit punk ass taking advantage of black women ass no more in front of the camera. The boys club is over with. You just been exposed, bitch. And black women gonna stand up. I hope that girl go on live, rally the troops, and them goddamn lawyers, them black lawyers, the same ones that been running and, and getting everybody else. They need to get your motherfucking ass too, punk. I'm trying to, I told y'all they hide in groups. <laughs> they want to make all these goddamn friends so they can cover up that bad behavior. Yeah, you little nasty bitch, you. Don't nobody bet not let their daughter around you. Shit. Especially not with a club soda or nothing with a fizz in it. You nasty bastard. Talking about dropping Spanish flying girls drink, waiting on them to get drunk. Fuck wrong with you, nigga. And them white boys let you put that shit on the radio. But you wanna y'all wanna run in the street talking about Black Lives Matter, but you let this motherfucking nasty violator of black women on your motherfucking show and pay them double the salary. Nasty motherfucker. But then you come out and call me crazy because I'm making sense. I guess I'm supposed to be a violator like you, then I wouldn't be crazy, huh, bitch? Cause all you nasty motherfuckers do. Fake like you important and have your little secret shit together. Take advantage of motherfuckers. Now the world know if they go into the wrong room with some of you nasty motherfuckers, black women just know. If y'all don't kick this nigga in the ass, it could be your turn. And then you could be with somebody that turned their head on your motherfucking ass. Make an example that he can't goddamn do that to no fucking woman. Get that girl some peace and kick this nigga draws in his ass. Fuck wrong with y'all.